I'm Ben Messenger for Waste Management World. We're in Munich at the EFAT exhibition. I'm on the Harco stand with Olaf. Olaf, I see you've got three new vehicles out here. Yeah. Can you tell us about them? Well, first of all, I, I'd like to introduce the new Tremo T+. T+, is like a standard Tremo, but we have some additional things on it uh, that make it more useful to the customer. Uh, in comparison to all our other Tremo range, this is the most simple uh, vehicle, so the most, of course, cheapest one uh, in the sense of the price, but it has some addition in the equipment that makes it useful for those who have, let's say, a multifunctional application with limited range. So it's not multifunctional for all but at least for winter services this machine can handle some items so basically it's a transporter with some hydraulic functions with some working functions which are kept at the le lowest level at the most simplest level in order to make it at a reasonable price to the customer you can have in other equipment it is a very sophisticated high level hydraulic equipment lots of electronics everything but this is a simple one and in some cases to be simple is something new and that is why we introduce the Tremo T plus and what type of tasks is this machine able to carry out for a municipality? As I said, first of all, it's a transporter. Yeah. So it's a useful little truck within the company, within the municipality's range. But it can, of course, do at least winter services, as you can see, with a snowplow snow and a spreader. And it has a load bed, or in this case, this is a refillable spreader by the load bed. So most of all, the transportation task for a general purpose within the municipality, but also for winter services. It can either operate a brush or a snowplow in front, but that's what it is limited to. It it can't do any mowing, it can't do any crazy things like a lifter or like a forklift or whatever, but it is reduced to the two functions of transportation and winter services. Great. Should we take a look at the other machines here? Yes, of course we can do so. So Olaf, I know Harco is producing a whole product line of multifunction yeah. machines. Can you tell us about that? Yeah, well, we're actually presenting here in the IFA 2014 a good lineup of all our product range. So we found a gap in between the largest city sweeper, City Master 2000, and the intermediate size, City Master 1250. So it really, like in there, there was a gap in the product range. And this is what we are going to fill up by the new City Master 1600, which is uh, on show here, first time in the world, by the way. And uh, this new machine de definitely fills up this gap. This gap is not only in size of the machine, but also in the sense of demand of the customer. It fills up a very specific gap, which is now more or less like created by driver's license reasons. So it seems to be a little bit strange to design a sweeper and multifunctional rig only because of uh, reasons of legal uh, demands of a uh, driver's license. But anyway, you know, most uh, we have now by 10 years or 15 years ago, even uh, U European Union modified the whole regulations concerning the driver's licenses and now everyone uh, doing a driver's B license is only allowed to have three and a half tons capacity in the vehicle mm -hmm. so total weight of the machine so all those before had the right to drive machines with seven and a half tons so now any new sweeper you know would require a truck driver's license and so now we do a sweeper that now fits in the standard B license Besides, it's good for the pavements, to, you know, three and a half tons is okay with the pavements and especially in Germany we have a regulation saying no more weight than three and a half tons on the pavements. So these machines we're seeing here, I left, anyone can come in and drive one of these as long exactly. as they've got a regular car driver. If you license. give me the right amount of money, you can drive away straight away and it's okay with your driver's license. Well, I'll just have to go and get my wallet. <laughs> yeah, well, give, give it a good try, I would say. But anyway, the, in, in, the amazing thing about this machine is that it transports the whole quick change system, the electronic command, the very simple electronic command of the whole machine from the very small machine, City Master 600, we introduced last year. And it's just like the big brother of the City Master 600. It's not just because of the name 600 and 1600, but anyway, this is the larger brother to the small one. And it has a very efficient quick change system that allows the driver only, with only his hands, to change the function within a few minutes. So really no tools required. The only thing required as a tool, let me see that, is this kind of key. So this is just to open up some doors in the machine, but it's not really like a tool you use regularly. So, but only with your hands, you can easily take off the attachments and transform it from a sweeper into, a, let's say, a winter service vehicle or into a mower or whatever, but only with your hands. Well, that's very impressive. I'm sure they're going to be very popular. Sure. I have to say the reaction of the public to this machine is really amazing. They are very much convinced that this suits very well in their demands. And 
I have to say, I'm a little bit proud of the work the team of Harco has done on this because this is not my, ta my team um, or my part of the world only, but it's a really t big team working on this. And I have to clap my hands for all those team members that this came out at the end. And where can our viewers go to find some more information about these? Yeah, but anyway, visit us on hako.com, so hako.com, and there you will find anything new and of interest on Hako, ranging from the smallest vacuum cleaner up to the largest city master, including all the multi-car range. So be, please feel free and visit us at the internet site of Hako. Oh, it's been great talking to you. Thanks, Thanks. for your time.